the governor's call concerns service delivery in the province and the disadvantages of insufficient provincial and district support improvement program grants. The district of Talasia, having more than 230,000 people living in a scattered huge geographical location, and Kendry and Gloucester have no road connection and depends mainly on sea transport. Governor Mutuvel said the PSIP and DSIP funds are calculated depending on the number of districts a province has. Of course, we have some disappointments, Minister, that uh, we are not very happy that when government removed or reduced these LLGSIP funds. I think we should reinstate because LLG is a government on itself. They should also deliver services within local level, government level. Although attempts were made for them to have more districts, the Electoral Commission Boundary Report has not been acknowledged and approved by past governments. Governor Mutuvel said, Although West New Britain province produces more revenue to the government through oil palm, little money is received. He also said no big development impact is seen in the 10 million Kina PSIP fund received. Now this is like 10 million too, you come up on time, this is like guidelines. Blow a deal or tackle same two million equal of health, na two million equal of uh, education, na three million low infrastructure, na one million goal of law and order, na one million goal of economic activities. Governor Mutuvel urged the government to allocate funds according to the population, geographical marks, and the difficulties in service delivery. He said all these factors have to be differentiated so that the people receive the level of service delivery that they deserve. Vasinatayama National MTV News, Kimbe.